Hi, I'm Deanne Lacay. I'm a rheumatologist at the University of British Columbia and a research scientist at the Arthritis Research Center of Canada. Rheumatoid arthritis is an inflammatory kind of arthritis. It's due to the immune system reacting against the self and causing inflammation in the joints. And when inflammation is left untreated over time, it causes damage to the joints. So people over time get deformities, especially in their hands and feet, and also over time lose physical function. We've also recognized recently that people with RA are at an increased risk of premature death especially from cardiovascular disease. We did a review of studies and found that people with rheumatoid arthritis had a 50% greater chance of dying from heart disease than the general population. The way we treat rheumatoid arthritis has drastically changed in the last 10 years. DMARDs are disease-modifying anti-rheumatic drugs and they treat the underlying cause of the disease rather than simply reducing symptoms. It's important to start DMARDs early because there is a window of opportunity when the disease is more responsive to treatment. And when we treat within that window, we have a much better chance of stopping the damage to the joints and also of getting remission. DMARDs also reduce the risk of premature death. We have shown that using methotrexate, which is the most commonly used DMARD, reduces the risk of death by 60% and the risk of death from cardiovascular disease by 70%. We did a study to look at how the people across BC are being treated for their rheumatoid arthritis. And what we found was that only 48% actually received a disease-modifying anti-rheumatic drug over a period of five years. We also found that this was closely linked to whether or not they saw a rheumatologist. And that's because most family physicians are not comfortable prescribing DMARDs on their own. So it seems that there are family physicians who are not aware of the recent shift in how we treat rheumatoid arthritis. To improve care for rheumatoid arthritis, we are developing some concrete tools for family physicians to help them treat RA according to current guidelines. We also want people to think about cardiovascular disease risk in people with RA. So people should be screened for their cholesterol, their high blood pressure, they should be advised to exercise and not to smoke. What we need is actually a mentality shift. People have to recognize that one, RA is not a benign disease. Two, we have effective treatment to treat it. And three, these medications need to be started early, need to be used consistently and aggressively, and we need to aim for completely getting rid of the inflammation. Remission is now our goal in treating rheumatoid arthritis.